Hi, I'm Mark Richard Adams, post-production professional. Come join me for another post demonstration on Colour Me In. Hey, and welcome back. Okay, today we're gonna to do a short video in Avid using the collapse function and trying to knit together a couple of images with an alpha channel in between, okay? Now the way that we're gonna do that is we are going to first go to motion five. Now in motion five, I've created a uh, text, white and black, just matte, that's all it is, nothing special about that. But I wanna use this as the, uh, the map or the alpha channel. I'm gonna go to share, I'm gonna to go to save current frame. I just need it to be uh, PNG and color only, no alpha, okay? So it's just a flattened file. I'm gonna call this uh, version five mat. Export that, there we go. Minimize, jump back into Avid. Okay, we're in Avid. So now we've just made that file, we want to import it. And we're gonna to go to source browser, and there it is there. Do make sure in the settings window here, in, in link options, that the alpha channel is set to ignore. Uh, because this is a flat file, okay? So this, this might be a file that never originally came with an alpha channel or just something you wanna make into an alpha channel, okay? Click OK, link that in, and there we go, good. Now we've got our sequence here, and we want to uh, put camera A down first, so just going to do this, plot that down there. There is a camera A, camera B, I'm gonna put video layer two, Act and there we go, plot that down. And on video layer three, I'll mark it in again and on out. And I'm just going to want this map, there we go, so that map card there, that single frame to go on to video layer three. So we have our camera A, camera B, and the mat. Okay, now, now we use a collapse function. So I'm going to highlight video layer three, shift, highlight video layer two and go over to this icon here, the collapse icon. There, click that, and it claps it down. It's almost like a nest in Premiere or Final Cut Pro 10, actually. And you can see that we now can see video layer um, one and just video layer two with the mat. So if you double click inside there, it'll expand and you can see both clips. Okay, so there they are here, and there's both clips inside that sort of nest or a collapse as Avid calls it. Um, now what I need to do is search for in key the mat key okay and i'm going to drag that mat key onto our mat png file and when i do that you can see if i close that collapse we can see that the hole has been cut so inside here we have a camera b and we have a mat and we've got the mat key cutting that hole there and you can make that more defined of course by Collapsing it down, maybe going to video layer one. Um, just jumping into the color page here and just having a little fiddle around with it. Okay, just making it a little bit more obvious. There's something there. Maybe change the color, maybe do something cool. There we go. Um, close that down. And there we go. We have our two clips uh, and we have our matte layer. Our matte layer has been collapsed into this file here and a matte key been added. And then we've color corrected the results um, with that. So you can use this for pretty much anything. This is like a really simple demonstration. I hope you find that useful. Um, so in Avid, if you find yourself needing to uh, create an alpha channel just to create a wipe or mix you out for something or, or to do other interesting things in Avid as well. Do remember the collapse function in Avid over here is really useful and can dig you out of really quite, uh, dig you out of a lot of holes. Hope you enjoyed the video. Take care. If you enjoyed that video, give me a like or subscribe. Put in the comments down below demos you'd like to see next. We'll catch you next time.